Hey guys, Marco here, back once again from MyColorScreen.com bringing you the latest and greatest Android home screen tutorials. Today I'll be featuring the, the screen by none other than Gary Arts called Tiled. Now as you can see it's called Tiled because it's got these calm, cool, collected tiles at the bottom that open up many, many apps such as opening up our dialer by tapping that. We can open up our Gmail by tapping these tiles, very easy to get a hold of. Look at that, it opens up your music very legit this polished off by this awesome clock here as you can see it's got our little battery remaining around the edges very very cool yeah this tutorial is highly recommended for beginners is that it's very easy to use let us begin with today's tutorial okay starting from our apex launcher that is extremely stock we want to be changing a few settings so i'll push down the menu button go apex settings you want to go to home screen settings portrait grid a nine by seven as well as everything on none manage screens you want two screens wallpaper mode you want multiple screens scrolling that is because we'll be using multi-picture live wallpaper for this video funny you want to hide the notification bar like that and you want to hide icon labels go back you want to go into your dock and you want to hide the dock like that next you want to go into behavior settings you want to go into your swipe up and you want to change it to show app draw this might be only for the pro version but it's definitely worth it as there's no app draw button for this screen you'll just have to swipe up but it looks really cool i'll show you that later you want to go into advanced settings and you want to resize any widget overlapping widgets and yeah that is it we'll go back and that is your apex settings done next we want to move on to our wallpaper awesome now for our wallpaper we want to hold down and choose wallpapers and you want to choose live wallpaper and you want to download this free app called multi picture live wallpaper really amazing app right here and you want to go into settings add individual settings go one okay add individual settings again two okay boom screen one settings you want to go into your picture source single picture now if you've got a galaxy s2 i rather recommend using your quick pick and just selecting the wide screen that that includes this two screens combined just as just as it'll save a bit more ram than using multi-picture live wallpaper but if you've got a nexus or S3 or any other phone, I recommend Multi-Picture Live Wallpaper. This app is amazing. So you want to go into Tiled Sep Walls as they've been separated now for you. And you, for the first screen, you'll select the first one. And then for the second screen, you'll select the second one. This one over here. Boom. Now remember, if they don't fit after that, you want to go Crop Resize Ratio. ratio. Fit to full screen or a show entire picture. One of those options will work for you. But I've just left it off because mine's fit quite well. So you want to take off show reflection and that's about it you want to go back and you want to go set wallpaper boom bam how it is set for you as you can see scrolling back and forth wallpaper done next and finally will be our widgets great now for our widgets we'll be using uccw so you want to hold down on the home screen and select widgets you want to select uccw now for the bottom ones we'll start off with those we want to choose a 4x4 but as always it doesn't really matter because you're using a predefined one anyway now you want to go into open user and you want to find the files that you have copied onto your phone that are provided in the link below here we have tiled remember tiled one is for first screen tiled two is for second screen so we've got tiled one for the first you want to tap there and then you want to resize this like this it goes resize just to make it fit or very nice on your phone there we have it now as you can see our gmail over here our notification ain't looking too good so we want to tap our uccw bring up the, the options and you want to go select object gmail one change it scroll all the way change your account and then change your label to inbox or whatever you want next thing you want to really do is go select object and go hotspots as you can see it'll make your screen look all colorful and that's because it's got one two three four hotspots as you can see, the first one here is called X Dialer. So if you don't have X Dialer, you just want to change it. You want to select Hotspot. You want to go UCCW and you want to select Dialer. That will enable your dialer like that. If you want to go to your second one, which is your email, you want to go Hotspot, select two, Hotspots, app, because it's an app now, and you want to select your Gmail. It looks really cool. Now you do that for, for both Hotspots three and four if you don't like those ones as well. And then from there, you'll just go back because you don't want to go turn on your hotspots yet as you want to add in this one as well so you want to add in this widget this uccw skin remember it'll be your second tiled one and once you have resized it you want to also go into this one and change your hotspots so you go select object hotspots as you can see it looks pretty much the same so say for your music you don't want that z player you'll go select hotspots select app and choose any music player that you want i'll choose apollo 
and now you want to go your options hotspots mode on that will now turn on your hotspots so you can double check tapping that will bring up Apollo boom finally you'll add in your clock obviously if you want your clock to be hotspot mode on then don't turn on your hotspots mode just yet you might want to add in a one by one as the other skins might have taken up a bit more room and this will enable you to resize it so as you can see there's our teeny tiny clock right there you want to just resize that now there we have it now we want to do it to the other screen as well and there we have our home screen complete for today as you can see there it is all set up tap in an icon will bring it up and don't forget about your app drawer by swiping up it'll bring it up boom home screen complete video tutorial complete hope you've enjoyed it please remember to subscribe to the my color screen channel as our videos are continually growing daily so you don't want to miss out thank you very much guys for watching this is marco from my color screen and i'll see you around next time